Good day, traders. Yes, it is your trade of the day, and today it's brought to you by, as every day, Day Trade the World. Make sure you scan that QR code below. And you've probably been hearing us talk about it all day. It's pretty choppy today. Like, I just feel like when you're looking here at the NASDAQ, it's been a very, very wild day. This is where we opened up. Nice move to the top side. And again, with all this bank contagion, all this risk, like very uncertain of what was going to happen. Then bounce, 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 bounce. Finally make some new highs up there near 12200. And right now, we're kind of just hovering around. But the thing about this trade of the day, it's pretty simple, and I got into it late. And the key is, wait for levels to develop. If you're gonna sit here and trade something like a meta here, look what I waited for. This area that I indicated right there is 181. So unfortunately, look how choppy this is in the morning. I mean, whether, you know, unless you caught the very top, I mean, it's a huge move to begin with. It was very, very choppy in here, but we knew we wanted meta long. Why? Look at the percentage metas up. 1.73 versus the market. Well, one point, now we've taken off to the upside, so we're about, about more even. But Meta all day has been outpacing the market. So what did we do? We found a 181, but not only that, it, since it's been trading with the market, look what else we found on the market down here, 1250. So this little bump area that kept on resisting and getting some support down there, that's 1250 or so. That was coinciding with this level right here on Meta of 181. So we came in a couple times. We're able to get it out a bunch of times there. And right before we came, I came up to here, I was thinking about... I mean, I had an offer right here at 183 because if I'm gonna play the bottom, like right now we're long 181 and meta right here is at 182.60, right? So it's a huge move up. But look, look at that top, 183. If we think that the market's gonna be hard to trade today and it's range bound, then we should probably be getting out at those levels once it hits the top. Like if we're playing the bottom, once it hits the top, we need to be getting out of that. But I wasn't sure where this market wanted to go. So we're holding our last 10% for that top, which I was there and I canceled it. Should have probably put it back. But again, that is your trade of the day for two reasons. One, we let it sort of, we'll go this way. We let it sort of calm down, right? Give us a level, give us something to trade off of. We think we found that at 181. Not only that, but it coincides with this bottom as well of the NASDAQ. So we know that we're not trading the futures, we're trading actual equity and it's meta, but it's following the futures. They're both bouncing off the same levels. So, hey, if the market rips, we know we got a good one here with meta. Meta is a positive stock. We have a couple negatives. And we'll talk about that in a minute, but it's meta for your trade of the day.